In this video, I will use cron job to process PHP scripts. So for example, I write a little script in PHP and a long job to process, for example, daily. For example, I have a very simple PHP script. Just echo this uh, test. Of course, in the future, I will write a very complicated script for cron job. But this is a basic, very basic PHP script. So when I run this script test the PHP, it always this is a test for cron job. So we can easily to write a shell script. This shell script, for example, run this HTTP SSL. This is my test the PHP location, and I use wget to use this option. This no check certificate values or this option may you only get the output not get a total file. If you did not use any uh, this option here, use wget, you will get uh, the file, not output. But this, this one, you will get the output here, display the output. So first run this script, you can see here. So first, chmod plus x. Let this shell script executable. Uh, chmod sorry this one so after this one then we can run this test of sh so you can see uh, it will get output here display the output so anyway you use wget you will run this uh, test of php run this script But there's a potential problem. If we base it on this script to write a cron job, because everybody can access this script. So we better to modify this script. We don't want to let anybody access this one. So it's better to use PHP and run this test of PHP. So we better directly run use PHP, run PHP test dot PHP to run this PHP script, not uh, run by the web server. So we better to use PHP test of PHP instead of use wget to run this uh, in the server side. We directly use the shell to access to run this one to create a cron job. Then we are in the dot ht assessed. Run this file. Put this ht dot ht assess. Then we deny from all in this directory. So we made this server you cannot assess. So after you set the dot ht assess, when the people running this one, you will get the error message here. So now look at this directory. I have uh, to ht access to protest the test PHP from outside. In the test sh is a shared script executable. So we check this one. I did not use wget from outside. I directly use the internal to PHP run this test PHP. So we can now we can run the cron job. So now I run the cron job, uh, not this one, control C here. Cron tab minus E. This is one, I will create a new one. So at this one, this is the each night, 11 o'clock, 30. This is each night, run TSH, this script, output in the test log. Of course, if you is not the same directory, you can write a complete directory and complete uh, absolute directory also better. You can use the cron tab minus L. Then you can list all the cron job. You can see this is a run daily. In the test SH is a PHP script. And we run this one each night. 